What is up, Jujutsu nerds? Welcome back to the Matrix channel. This is Nick versus Bruno. Um, narrated role again. And we start right away. Bruno steps on Nick's thigh here to block the action of his bottom leg to pass his guard. You saw the Rutolo brothers do that recently a lot. So it's an interesting strategy. You could definitely play around with. Bruno's doing that for a few weeks now, I guess. Maybe even just days. You never know with these young kids. Um, yeah, but that also shows how quickly you can incorporate something in your game. Um, here, the good old strategy of first catching the heel, then putting the legs in place. He doesn't even get... Oh, no, he gets a good bite of the heel. Sorry. Right away, um, Nick should pummel heavily with his, uh, like rotate to the left and pummel his right leg in. Of course, this should be a learning experience for Nick too. Um, that's my goal in this video. Um, if heel slipping is already too late, but there's no real leg control around your own leg, you can still spin with the heel hook um, and pummel your second leg in. A lot of, of your escapes come from the second leg as we all learned from John Denner. Here, his left arm is extended and he lets Bruno grab his wrist for a long time. Never, never let anybody do this. Keep your arms tight and make your own grips. So that's the next um, takeaway here for, for Nick. And uh, yeah, Bruno's a killer in the back mount. It's extremely hard to escape his back if you're not super, um, like a lot bigger than him, stronger and good. Um, cross grips here, trap trap of the top arm, doesn't get it, so um, keeps on grip fighting. Um, yeah, I'll uh, show Nick some ways of, um, like a main way of, of getting out of the body triangle, at least momentarily to make uh, the rest of the escape work. Um, I keep going. Bruno looking for inside position. Nick should be a little more active here, just attacking Bruno from the guard instead of just being passive. He tries the the, uh, the leg step thing again. Little cartwheel to make things happen. And um, Toriano passing to the neon belly. Bruno has a has a whole um, series of of techniques that he uses to uh, for this kind of guard passing. He, um, we did videos on the on the YouTube channel too about that. Um, yeah, this is some some rubber guard action. I would say I'm not competent at all in the rubber guard. But basically, what is this this doing? Like he uses his um, the hand and his left leg to keep Nick's posture broken. It's as simple as that. Then he grabs his shin with the right arm and comes uh, under, uh, comes over with the left arm too. Switches the right arm to have um, to be more tight on the neck. Maybe he tries to go for a choke here by grabbing uh, with his left arm on his left leg, but it doesn't work. So he transfers to the regular triangle instead. It's not that Bruno is a rubber guard player or, or something where he's just flexible and um, can grab his leg easily and pull it over your head. All right, guys. So um, I hope you liked the video. If you have um, questions, just let us know in the comment section. Shoot us a comment if you want to see specific videos. Please um, subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell, follow us on Instagram and stay on the mats. Us.